Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be looking at some leaked stuff coming to Prodigy, so let's get into the video. Alright, so we got some new stuff added in game, including two new pets, so let's go ahead and check them out. These are going to be evolutions of Cloud Gobbler and I believe Arbite. So we are going to go ahead and find them in the pet book and I'll show you guys what they look like. So here we have Arbite and if we want to evolve it, which I barely have the magic coin to do, I think I'm going to have to hack the other one on. But we can see that there is a new pet called Geist right here. We're going to go ahead and level, or I guess evolve this. So now we have Geist, which that is its attack animation right there. And it looks kind of weird. Um, so it has a health of 1930, a power of 1520, a dodge of 1150, a defense of 970. And I don't know, I think that order is probably they may have forgotten to add it or it's just a glitch, I don't know. And then if we go to its description, it says Geist have a perpetual thundercloud with many lightning strikes on top of their head, which gives their stormy temperament, I believe that says down there. So the spells that it does are multi-spark, um, battery, sunder, and skyrend. I don't think this is too good because it has three different multi-spells, and, um, or I guess team spells, and then it has multi-spark, which not great spells, I would say. And then the other one that we have is an evolution of Cloud Gobbler, so I'm going to have to hack that on. So here is Cloud Inhaler. We have it on level 100. It's a legendary. And yeah, this is what it looks like. It's kind of weird. Uh, I don't really know how to describe it. It has a big underbite, which is a little weird. Um, and yeah, it kind of just feels a little off, but it has a health of 2,110, a power of 827, a dodge of 943, and a defense of 943. For some reason, it also does not have an order. And then if we go to its description, it says, when you can't see a single cloud in the sky, you know the cloud inhaler were busy munching away earlier. So, yeah, that's the description. It spells, it does chain lightning, uh, life jolt, spark storm, and overload. So, not great, I would say, but it's fine, I guess. Um, so yeah, those are the two pets that were added. We also have a mount and a buddy that were added, which I believe are going to be for the next treasure track. So if we go over to mount, we have a new one right here, which is called the Magic Map. It is really cool, so if we go ahead and put it on, um, this is what it looks like. We'll get a little into what it looks like a little later, so that you can actually see what the map looks like. And it says, Ancient Mystical Map of Sunken Treasure. That will take you somewhere. So, I think this will be in the next treasure track, which... Is supposed to be like mysteries of the sky or something like that i'm not sure um but i think this will be for that treasure track we also got a new buddy which i think will be for that treasure track as well this one is not great it's called the wooden chest and it has a defense bonus of 25 and it says what could possibly be inside this wooden chest what a mystery so we can go ahead and put this on and yeah, this is what it looks like when it follows you. So nothing too great. Also, there were a few new morphs, which I guess will be in the next treasure track as well. So we can go ahead and look at those. I think it's just going to be the hot air balloon morph and the snoots morph. The snoots morph will be a minute long and then the hot air balloon will be 10 minutes so yeah i guess that is everything that was added into the game now we're going to look at a few things that were not and also just so you guys can see what the uh, map is supposed to look like this is what it looks like it sort of seems like it's supposed to be the map of prodigy here we can see 
that this sort of looks like Bonfire Spire. This looks like Shiver Chill. I'd say this is probably supposed to be Firefly Forest. Uh, this would be the Coliseum, and then this would be the Academy or Lamplight Town, maybe. So yeah, that is what the map looks like. And then a few other things that I didn't really show in game. This is um, Cloud Inhaler. Um, just so you guys can see its animations. This is its attack animation right here. Um, yeah, it looks pretty good, I would say. Um, we can also look at some of the other ones. Here is the idle animation for it, which I assume was what we saw. And then here's the walk animation, which you're pretty much never going to see. And then the icon for, I guess it's Geist or something like that. I already forgot the name of it. But this is what the icon for it is supposed to look like. And then here are its animations. So this is the attack animation for it. Um, it's fine, I guess. We also have the idle animation for it, which I think we saw. And then we have the walk animation for it, which is just that. So nothing too interesting there. Now moving on to a few pieces of pet gear that were added. I assume these are probably going to be some sort of special offer that if you buy membership, you can get this. So not really too exciting, I would say. But this is one of the pet hats that was added. Um, I'm not really even sure what it's supposed to be. It kind of just seems like a hat with a leaf on top of it. We have what seems to be like a winter hat. We sort of already have a hat like this that's blue and ice themed. Um, but this one seems to be plant themed and it has an orange leaf on it. We also have this one, which I'm not sure. This seems to just be a leaf with some stars on it. Kind of odd. And then we have three pet gears that we can look, or relics that we can look at. So we have this one, which is just a leaf, nothing too interesting. We have this one, which um, I don't know what this is called. It's sort of like a flute. Uh, I don't know what its actual name is. And then we have this thing, which I have no idea what this is supposed to be. A few other things that were changed. It seems like Hollow Jack's um, health and defense were slightly decreased um so its base is now 750 and its base defense is now 7 or 150. some of the pet gears that were leaked a few days ago or i guess it was probably like a few weeks ago they were added into the game so the trident tiara was added which had is a rarity of two and it does a health bonus of 113 there was the Spyglass Beret, which has a health bonus of 119. And there was the Turnip, Turnip Cap, which has a health bonus of 76. Mossy Trapper with a health bonus of 120. I believe these are the ones that were added today, I'm guessing. And then there was the Laurel, Laurel Thrawn, which has a health bonus of 147, which is pretty good. And then we have the base clasp with a power bonus of 115, the harp brooch with a power bonus of 102, and the plant symbol with a power bonus of 95 somehow, pan pipes with a power bonus of 118, and then the shepherd's crook with a power bonus of 121. And then finally, um, there was a file that was added for hard mode. Um, it's not an image or anything, it was just like some code, which could indicate that we might be seeing the final Academy hard mode come out tomorrow. I'm not 100% sure on that though. It could come like next week or in a few weeks. I'm not 100% sure, but it could be a good sign. I believe the file was called like hard in or hard end game which um those would have the encounters that you'd have so it would show pippet um all the elemental bosses and then the puppet master so those seem like they're those are going to be the things that we're going to be battling kind of as we would expect but yeah that is going to go ahead and end up the video if you guys enjoyed make sure to like subscribe and bye